Right, this is my FMP journal, or my journal for my final project, the week number two. So, I started off the week with being in on Monday to collect the equipment that I needed. That included a camera, an audio recorder and a selection of microphones with a tripod. I then was also getting ready to travel to London on the Tuesday. So that's all I really did on Monday. On Tuesday I was travelling up to London. That took a lot of the day. And then there wasn't really a lot I could do for the rest of the day. So I, I didn't really do... A lot then on Wednesday I had a funeral that I went to so I couldn't do anything in the morning although I managed to get some action shots from a GoPro on top of a, a remote controlled car it's not quite the same as it being on a bike or on a person on a bike although it is practice using it and practice with knowing how to set it all up correctly and I feel from this I have mastered the technique of setting up a GoPro with the formatted card that I've got on Thursday I was changing the place where I was staying because I was in a hotel on Tuesday and Wednesday night and then on Thursday night I was staying with my grandparents in South East London or my grandparent in South East London and that meant that by the time I got over there and started editing what I'd got with the GoPro the night before I didn't exactly have time to to do anything on Friday I was meant to be um, filming this and getting everything sorted with that but then I was meant to be filming what I, I was meant to be filming test shots on Sunday and on Thursday but I didn't manage to do that on Thursday so then I went and did it on Friday instead so I got the train from the station to Charing Cross before walking down to the embankment near there. So I got I got cinematics of cyclists coming past and the surroundings. I didn't really get many of them, so I'll put in the ones in the test shots where I can. As I'm recording this, I've, because this is on the Monday afterwards, because I didn't manage to get a lot done while I was there of recording this journal although I remember everything that I did so yeah that's what I did on Friday then I got the train from St Paul's underground to Stratford where I then tried to get a um a still shot of the velodrome there without being on their property as that as if I was on a pavement near their property like with the camera in my hand or on a tripod it wouldn't class as disrupting the public so I would be allowed to do that legally the trouble I had was that I couldn't get a good enough angle where I could get the whole velodrome in 
and cars kept on coming past so I couldn't really get the perfect shot. I'm still away I'm also still awaiting permission to actually film on the premises from the company. Although at this point it doesn't look like I'm gonna get a response. On Saturday I no, on Friday I travelled on Friday evening I travelled to my cousin's house to stay the night there ready for the cycle race tomorrow or on Saturday. After I was there I stayed the night, went to the race in Buckingham and got some got some shots there of the preparation and the actual and a few shots of the actual race. The ones I did get will be in will have already been on the blog. I can't remember exactly what they were but I got some. I feel that I now have worked out from this that I need to have a low angle filming the cycling and a medium like uh, I need to have the camera at a low height looking up for the for the cycling and then for the like, the preparation I need to have the camera at a medium height so it's about halfway up the person and it can be tilted up and down depending on which area they're preparing for the race. End of at the end of Saturday I was just driving back or not not driving getting a lift back from the cycle race and then on Sunday I was getting a coach on the way back that is well all of the things that I was doing in that time is the reason that this is laid up as I didn't really have any time to film it, edit it and upload it other than today. So this is the Monday now and I have continued a bit with my research and handed the equipment back in.